Hector Herrera coming to Houston. Houston Dynamo GP Pat Onstad talking about the new signing, saying he is the biggest signing in club history, and I don't think anyone else is particularly close. Now, in the previous edition of Football Americas, this completely got the two of them, Seb and Herc, arguing, debating. It was extremely heated. So I can only imagine what the latest edition is going to be like now that we know Hector Herrera is here. Here's a little clip of what we saw from them. MLS money makes you comfortable, and comfortable players don't produce at the international uh, level. Well, the U.S. literally failed to qualify player. for the last World Cup because Tell guys me. were comfortable in MLS. That has nothing to do with this circumstance. You have a player who was three months in MLS, went to the World Cup, and didn't produce at the World Cup, Carlos Vela. Now you're telling me Hector Herrera, another player is going to come to MLS and produce at the World Cup? I understand your disdain for Major League Soccer. I do. You've been a DC United fan for all your life. I understand uh, the disdain for Major League Soccer. Yeah, let, I'm, I'm let upset at Major League you, Soccer because I gave you a career, and now we're here. You, if you go to a worse level of training and a worse level of game competition in the months before a major tournament, there's nothing logically that tells but me you're But you're assuming improve. it'll be worse than what he's already at right now because you're he doesn't right. play right now. You're right. Houston Dynamo and Atletico Madrid very comparable on, on many fronts. Can you imagine the two of them tonight now that uh -huh. this is uh, now to make sure you do not miss the latest edition of Football Americas. It is streaming tonight and those two will no doubt be going at each other once again. Well, thank you very much for watching ESPN on YouTube. For more sports highlights and analysis, be sure to download the ESPN app. And for live streaming, premium content, and let's not forget as well, ESPN FC, seven days a week. Subscribe to ESPN+.